Hi, everyone. How are you today? Good. How are you? I'm good. Thank you so much for speaking with me. I had the pleasure of watching the first couple episodes of your guys' new season and fantastic. Uh, you're up in the ante. So from both of you, what can fans expect from both of your characters this season? Um, I think you can expect some uh, some surprises from Virgil. Uh, I think the first season set him up as, <clears throat> well, a, a slightly caring father uh, with some pretty major character defects, who is pretty alienated from his son. And I think there's a, a, the potential for reconciliation and for Virgil Poe to actually step up and be a dad for the first time. Uh, we'll see if that happens, but uh, I think it it might be in the works. Yeah, I think for Billy, it's kind of this <clears throat> new lease on life that he has, and he has a totally different perspective, and he's trying to to purge his past and make good with all his uh, all the people that he loves and cares about. And I think uh, when Virgil steps up and starts um, showing him a different way and tries to put the knife in his hand, literally, um, I think it shows that that connection is growing and that that Virgil really cares about uh, Billy that he hasn't really experienced that much through his past. For both of you, what surprised you most about your character this season? I mean, for me, I think what surprised me was him wanting to uh, get violent again. And although that is an impulse that he's had, I it was surprising to me how um, how strong of an impulse that that was, and that he he really didn't question it that much. I think that was something that was really surprising. Um, and also just the, the, the fact that the um, PTSD from the prison continued to come up in his life and affect him. Um, I, I wasn't expecting that as much. Yeah, and, and for me, uh, you know, if in the first season, you can sort of look at Virgil Poe as the, the village Lothario and, uh, and maybe a small time criminal to to make ends meet, but what he does for Billy um, towards the middle of the season is uh, it was so intense. It made me think there's a really hardcore edge to Virgil that we'd never seen before. Something that you should take very very seriously. A capacity for violence uh, that is on a different level than you'd think would be at Buell. But I think what I loved about that is it kind of helps explain Billy's reactions to things as you're finally seeing more connection between father and son, even though, you know, we saw glimpses of it in the first season. I feel like this season, your guys' dynamic just becomes that much bigger and we're starting to get answers to questions we had from the first season. I agree with you. And one of the, one of the more shocking scenes to me is when, when, uh, when Billy discovers his father in a tryst, in the middle of a tryst, that scene was really painful for me to do, to be honest with you, because a kid discovering that his father is betraying his mother and the, and the father being so um, harsh and in, inconsiderate when when the kid is you know showing, hey, dad, I won this award. Uh, w one of the most tragic scenes for me, but it says a lot about my relationship with Billy. And it shows a lot about what kind of distance Virgil has to make up uh, to, you know, to to be a father to his son. Well, for my final question for both of you is what are you hoping fans get from this new season? I hope that they, um, well, that's a good question. I hope that they can see uh, how willing people are uh, and how far people will go to to make ends meet with their past and to move on. And I think that's one of the, the themes of this season is everybody has a troubled past and what are they willing to do to move on and get past that? I mean, one of the themes I thought in last season that was very powerful that carries over into this season is how far will you go for love? And I hope that the audience falls in love with the characters enough to 
to get on their page and and empathize with what they have to do with the tools that they have in order to protect and save what they love. Perfect. Well, thank you guys so much. I'm so excited for everyone to see the new season. Me too. Thank you. Thank you.